The overall goal of this procedure is to determine the location, abundance, and phenotype of antigen-specific CD8-positive T cells within tissues of interest. This method helps answer key questions about CD8 T cells by providing a means to locate, quantify, and phenotype virtually any antigen-specific CD8 T cell in any tissue. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows determination of the spatial distribution of antigen-specific CD8 positive T cells relative to other cells and structures within tissues of interest. Demonstrating the procedure with Sheng Ben Li will be Guantua Mwokalundwa. On day one of the procedure, use a scalpel to cut the fresh tissue into approximately 0.5 by 0.5 centimeter pieces. Here, Reese's macaque spleen tissue is shown. Separately glue each tissue fragment into the middle of the top of a plunger and embed the samples in 3 to 5 milliliters of warm 4% low melting agarose in PBS. Label the plungers with the relevant tissue information. Then, place the samples in a chilled holder in an ice bucket. When the agar has solidified, turn on the microtome and set the thickness setting to 200 micrometers. After installing a new razor blade, insert the plungers into the microtome bath. Fill the microtome bath with 100 to 200 milliliters of freshly prepared PBSH and add PBSH ice cubes to maintain the